so many applications of anagram models in uh, speech processing and in text processing uh, let's uh, visit some of them uh, the first uh, very important application is uh, in OCR OCR means optical character recognition like you uh, use an image uh, of text and then you convert that image into a real text like you scan a newspaper and then uh, from this that scanned copy of newspaper you produce the actual text that's called that's done by the optical character recognition so uh, while scanning uh, a, and a newspaper or scanning a book if you uh, find some word is missing or uh, confusing that missing word is uh, very easily uh, predicted by the anagram models similarly if you use the handwritten uh, text for scanning uh, that had the handwritten text is normally uh, confusing so uh, for that scenario it's also very helpful uh, the second application is uh, correcting a sentence. Uh, when we write a sentence, if there is some spelling mistake, it is very easily identified by all the uh, word processors like MS Word or other uh, word processing applications. But if the spellings are correct, but the word is not uh, placed rightly, uh, then it is there is a, some there is problem. So, for example, uh, like if we write dear sir instead of dear sir this one so uh, here this dear and this dear both are right words in the dictionary so there's no spelling mistake here so the the normal uh, word processing application will not identify any error but if we use an anagram model uh, the anagram model will will suggest us that sir is normally followed by this dear not this dear so it will uh, you can you say it will uh, notify us that we should correct the this this phrase this is incorrect phrase so it's very helpful in such scenario and the next is speech recognitions uh, there are many applications these days uh, i think all the android and mobile smartphones have this uh, this feature that uh, you speak and the your, your speech is converted into text and there are many apps which uh, which can uh, even uh, google uh, offers a speech recogn recogn recognition uh, feature in, in, in search so you can use uh, this anagram model in speech recognition recognition as well so because there are many words in English and I think in, in all the languages that have the same sound but actually they are very different for instance uh, we have the word I and I so these have sa almost same sound but but they, they have quite different meanings so with the same sound, uh, you have to predict what is the right word in the sentence. This is done by the anagram model. Like if someone says, I am eating, the, the, the speech recognition application will not write E-Y-E -E here, but it will write this, this one here because it, is, uh, it comes in the start of the sentence. And normally, uh, M is followed by this I, not this I. So from the anagram model, uh, we can easily identify the right word in the given place of the sentence where two words have same sounds similarly if someone says his go i got hurt here we will use this i the, the part of the body so uh, the next application is in translation in translation uh, there are, we, we usually find many funny scenarios when we try to translate a sentence word by word for example, if we translate a sentence in in national language of Pakistan, like he is the biggest minister, then it will become he is the biggest minister of Pakistan. So it is very funny translation. But whereas if we consult with anagram model, the anagram model will suggest us that we should we should use he is the prime minister of Pakistan. So apparently, prime and the biggest are not much different. Uh, they they are almost the synonyms, but. Uh, the anagram model suggests us that the minister word is uh, mostly followed by the prime, not the biggest word. So we will use instead prime instead of uh, biggest. So these are few ap applications of uh, uh, these uh, anagram models. I think there some also uh, another application that is uh, suggestions while typing. So this this uh, this scenario is. Uh, you have observed i think all of you have observed it while typing on your mobile phones in mobile phone when we try to type some word 
we uh, similar words are suggested uh, these words are suggested depending upon two things the, the first thing is the spelling of the word and the second thing is uh, depending upon the anagram model because our uh, smartphone is automatically trained according to our uh, uh, text uh, text messages so based depending upon the uh, base, uh, on the basis of the anagram model uh, it suggests the right word uh, to be typed so these are a few of the applications of anagram models and there are many other applications as well uh, so as a whole you can say the anagram models are very important and the, you can say the building blocks of the uh, speech processing